the BAPS Hindu Mandir, beautiful in all of its glory right now, is going to see scores, thousands of people really coming together every single day. Uh, with its inauguration today, now the capacity of the temple is at about 10,000 people per day and at such a circumstance, how really are they going to manage massive crowds that come into this particular temple with the use of technology? And they brought in an India-based firm to do that. I've got with me Ankita, the co-founder of NanoVision, who's with us here. She's from Pune, and you've come down to help with the security system. Right. Explain to us how really it works. How were you roped in first for this? Uh, so we were in touch with Swamiji when he was developing this temple. So we thought that why not to give a solution where this, the queue where people are actually getting, uh, uh, I mean they are not able to cross that queue easily, so why not to ease that? And as our Prime Minister Modiji always says, ease of doing business or ease of the life, so we thought that why not to implement that into the temple instead of just saying that have it all corporate wide. Okay. And that's how we thought of this. and. Uh, if, as you rightly mentioned, there are 10,000 plus people and it's very difficult to manage the queues. Correct. So we were here last three, four days and a lot of people were mm -hmm. coming for different events. And uh, while they were coming, 50 plus, 50% uh, plus people have registered their face. Okay. So that, that shows that people are actually interested in removing the queue. So what does it mean? If you're saying registered your face. Mm -hmm. How does this work? Explain to us what is the security system put in place right now to enter the temple? Sure. So this temple has a mobile application called Festival of Harmony. Okay. Uh, people register themselves there. While registering, they take their selfie. Mm -hmm. And now we have stands over here and the system like this. Okay. So when they enter and if they are registered, and uh, if you are not authorized, then the authorized person comes. And if I am showing my own face, then you will see that it's showing my name. That's okay. welcome, Mrs. Ankita Sanjiti. So okay. the similarly, if somebody has registered, they'll get a green. And if you have a gate, then the gate opens and you can go in. Okay. And so you register on an app and then it goes forward absolutely. with the use of technology. Absolutely. It's as, as easy as possible. And the response time of the system is just 400 milliseconds. Interesting. So is this the first temple where, you know, you've used AI, where technology is being used to ensure security as well? Yes, absolutely. So this is the first temple and we are thinking to go miles for BAPS in all other countries as well. Congratulations to you and all the very best for the days ahead. Uh, interesting to see how different elements really have come together to bring alive this dream of a BAPS Hindu Mandir here in Abu Dhabi. And technology has played a big, big role in that. So as far as security goes, it's all the way AI, something the Prime Minister also talks about, and an India-based firm that's been roped in for the temple security. With video journalist Prem Chandra Mishra, this is Akshita Anand Gopal reporting from Abu Dhabi for India Today. If you like the video, do like, comment, share and subscribe.